Hey everyone, this is Stevie here, and today we are going to be looking at construction planes. Now these are super useful. We are going to be looking at the offset plane and the plane at an angle first. Next video we'll look at tangent plane and mid plane. Next video we'll look at plane through two edges, three points, and then we'll look at the last two. So what we're going to do is let's select our offset plane. Now if you read the little description, this is a plane that is offsetted from a face or another plane. So that means that we have to have a planar face, one that is flat, in order to be able to do this. So any face on here works, but only, you'll see, only the top and bottom of this cylinder work. But any plane here works, like these three planes work, and any face here works. So let's construct one. It's very simple. All you have to do is select a face, and then you just have to drag it up or down. Or if you want to go to an object, you have to select a point, and then that will select all the way down to that point. Now, additionally, if you had like, let's say we'll construct this offset here, and then we wanted to offset another plane from there, well, instead of selecting this face and offsetting it by like 30 millimeters or whatever, we can actually just select this plane and offset it by another 30 millimeters, and then have like even spacing the whole way through. Next type of plane is going to be our plane at an angle. Now if you read the description on this one, this goes through an edge, an axis, or a line at a specific angle. So once we have selected our line, so we can select any line, but you'll see the faces don't light up anymore, but the lines do, so we can select any of these lines or any axis here. We'll select, uh, like, let's say this one. And then you just can rotate this to choose the angle that you want. So we'll do like 45. And then we'll go and create a sketch here. Let's do like a rectangle like this, finish. And then we can actually use that to cut through this. And we'll press OK. Now that's some weird looking geometry. But you'll see it's like a perfect square. It's kind of cool. It's kind of like one of those optical illusions where like when you look at it from a different side, it looks super different. And then when you go and it lines up perfectly, it's a square. Anyway, basically that's pretty much how to do a plane at an angle. And they're pretty simple concepts. So we'll go again, plane at an angle, choose any line, and then once it's there, you just have to choose your angle that you want. So again, pretty easy, and it's just the angle. So I think that's it for now, guys. Uh, the next video, we're going to be going through tangent plane and mid plane, and then again, keep going through them consecutively. I didn't want to make the videos too long because I feel like it's easier to digest this type of information in shorter bursts. So thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe, comment down below what you'd like to see next, and we'll see you in the next video.